Hello everybody and welcome to Clear Path Guidance and Tarot. I'm going to do an update on Jungkook from BTS because people are wanting an update on him. It's been a while since they did a reading for him. Um, uh, I'm not going to do all the members of BTS, but I'm going to do Jungkook. All right. Uh, I'm going to focus mainly on his career. I'll see if anybody's coming into his life. Uh, if anybody would like to purchase a private reading, see my e my email will be at the bottom of the video. Um, you can email me. I'll get back to you. Come on up here. My dog wants up. I'll get back to you within 24 hours. And my readings I have out within less than five days. I'm clairsentient, clairvoyant. So I pick up other people's energies, feelings, emotions, that sort of a thing. Um, these videos I put out. Um, they are done no charge. YouTube does not pay me much to do videos. Like after about three or four thousand views, I get three dollars for it, four dollars for it. I do have welcome, um, uh, donations are welcome. I will put my PayPal link if you guys want to keep seeing more of these videos. Donate if you want to. Doesn't have to be a lot of money just to keep the channel going and I can buy new cards and, you know, just keep these videos coming for all of you out there that are really enjoying them. All right. Okay. So um, when I think about Jungkook, I really feel that he's loving life right now. He's enjoying his career. He's his friends, his family. Um, I feel like he's at the top of his work, like top of the world. Um He's really focused on BTS, but I don't know if he's going to be doing any singles, like if he's going to be um, going out there solo, but I feel his main focus is music and his career. And I think the last reading I did, I said that it's like his star is already shining, but it keeps rising. It's going higher and higher and higher. And... He's a very important part of BTS. I think they're all important. They all play a certain role, all right? But he is quite, it's, I don't know why, but I feel like he draws the crowd. You know, um, I know he's not the oldest in the group. I know RM, I th either RM is the oldest or he's, he's, you know, I feel like he's the mature of the bunch sort of a thing but um, I really feel that Jungkook is just really enjoying life right now and um, enjoying his his career and I feel like he's got a lot of projects on the go whether it's acting or you know more music or going solo or or um, I don't know if they uh, do any touring right now I mean, there's, most of the world is kind of shut down from that. So I think he's just really enjoying life, enjoying his career, and focusing on his music. All right, let's see what the cards say about Jungkook from BTS, his music. What are the message or career? What are the messages for Jungkook's career? What are the messages in regards to Jungkook's career? And the way I do my readings is I shuffle till one card falls out. Those are clarity cards and jumpers. If more than one card falls out, I put it back in the deck. What are the messages for Jungkook in regards to his career? What are the messages for Jungkook's career? What are the future messages for Jungkook's career? Future messages for Jungkook's career. Messages for Jungkook's career. What are the messages for Jungkook's career? What are the future messages for Jungkook's career? Okay, I should look up his birth date, but I don't have time. I don't know. Um, 
Okay, hold on. I'm going to look really quickly. I know you guys hate it when I do this. Uh, Jung Cook BTS birthday. September 1st, he's a Virgo. Okay. So he's a Virgo. Um, I asked what the messages were regarding his career. There's the five of wands. It's challenges, obstacles. He likes to have a lot of um, sport play, you know, even playing and having small little um, uh, challenges with the other guys from BTS. But I feel like there's passion here. When everything he does, he has passion. Then we have the Knight of Cups. And the Knight of Cups is talking about proposal. All right, I feel like he's going to keep getting proposals over and over um, in regards to his um, work life. The Knight of Cups, hold on here. I just want to get a deeper meaning. Where is it? So the Knight of Cups talks about promises, ideals, invitations. Uh, equally, you may project onto him or her a dreamy quality you ideally want. Um, he's going to get invitations and proposals. But he needs to be careful what he picks. This card is saying, but assess carefully what is an on, on offer. So I might get an offer to do a commercial. This card is saying, be careful what you pick. Be careful what is offered to you. Pick what is important. So this card is saying he's going to get a lot of proposals and a lot of offers, but he has to stop and don't just take everything. Stop and think about what is good for your career. Okay? Then we have the moon. There could be some illusions that come with these offers. All right? So this card is saying that there is confusion, sometimes disappointment or disillusionment. This is also about deception, uncertainty. So some of these offers that he's going to get, there might be some deception behind it, not fully truthful, and he might have some disappointment. Okay, so he has to be careful. But in the end, there is the Empress. The Empress represents beauty, money, abundance, um, all the nice things in life. You can see here is the sign of Venus on her arm. Venus is the planet of love and beauty and abundance. So his life is going to be abundant. Um, he's going to make some good choices. This is about creativity, authority, abundance, peace. She represents, uh, she symbolizes care, security, and abundance. Um, creative projects also thrive and love and his life is harmonious and new opportunities are unfolding for him and then we're back to the page of cups this is about creativity okay so the page of cups is about it's about good news creativity ideas the card means good news and often shows a young situation such as a project in development. So he's going to get some projects that he's going to be able to develop, particularly, particularly in writing and the arts. All right? So he might get some uh, uh, offers for doing maybe acting. Okay? All right, let's see. I know all of you want to know about love when it comes to Jungkook. So let's see what's going on for love. What are the future messages uh, for Jungkook in love? When I think about Jungkook, I feel like he's going to meet a really sweet girl. Uh, long, not too, like, almost like a bob. Dark hair. And she's going to be really sweet. Short. I feel like I, I feel like I see her being short. All right. I don't know if he's tall, but I feel like he's going to be like a whole head taller than her. All right. What are the future messengers for Jungkook in love? 
What are the future messages for Jungkook in regards to love? What are the future messages for Jungkook in regards to love? What are the future messages for Jungkook in regards to love? What are the future messages in regards to Jungkook for love? to love she's not in the industry though I want to say like either a friend is going to introduce her or a family member is going to introduce her she's going to be somewhat unaware of who he really is future messages for Jungkook and love messages for Jungkook regarding love. Future messages for Jungkook in love. All right, we have the Nine of Cups. So the Nine of Cups is wishes coming true. Again, we have abundance. Um, I feel like this relationship is going to be abundant and it's, his wishes are going to come true. Then we have the Death card, which talks about transition. This is, his life is going to change. This is going to be um, uh, when your life blooms and blossoms. This is about going from a cocoon to a butterfly. He's really going to come alive when he's going to be with this woman. Then we have the Eight of Pentacles, which talks about mastering something. He's going to work at this relationship. He's going to want to make it work. Then we have the star card. See, these two women here have the long dark, you know, they have longer dark hair. So she's shown up here twice in this reading. So this is about, this is the star card. It's about renewal, it's hope, it's miracles. He's going to get what he wants. And then we have the king of pentacles. There he is. He's shown up in this reading. He's the Virgo man. This card represents Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. And there he is, the solid practical man who has material success okay all right there you go that is the reading for jungkook from bts an update for all of you guys up there out there i think that i feel like jungkook is going to meet this woman within about the next year year and a half all right i said the same thing for rose rose and lauren um, I felt like somebody was going to come into her life, and I don't know what's going on there now, but um, I feel there's some that there's, um, you know, I kind of predicted that, and so I feel like this woman's going to come into his life, I would say, by next summer. So, all right, everybody, thank you for watching, sharing, liking, subscribing, thumbs up. I truly appreciate it. Um, if you guys like this video and you want to share it, put it on Twitter land and Instagram or whatever you guys do. Go ahead and share it as much as you want. All right, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.